welcome back to my channel and if you are new here my name is Lainey today we are going to do I guess you could say part two for our pirate decor speed build we are going to do the inside of Prince Eric's ship so grab a cozy spot maybe some coffee and sit back and relax with some gameplay I like to pick out the wallpaper and flooring first for most of my builds. I did struggle a bit though with this as I just could not decide which one fit best for a pirate vibe. I settled on the rough plank flooring and the white board and back wall. I do change the wallpapers later on in the build. Now I pull out items that I feel will fit the build, starting out with that helm bookcase, a perfect fit. Next are the windows. I have a few in mind to use, but I had to play around with them just to see which ones would work best. Here's where I decide that I did not like the look of the wallpaper and I decide to change it to the green damage baseboard. As you can see though, I still struggle picking it out. Before I can add or place any additional items, I need to figure out the layout of the windows and doors. I chose to place the windows across from each other on either side of the walls and I placed the doors close to the front in the corners. I crafted the charter rug for this build and placed it in the center of the room. I wanted to use as much furniture items as we get from Prince Eric as I could. Next, I add my pirate treasure map table from my last Touch of Magic video. 
I absolutely love how it turned out and I feel that it is the vibe of the whole room. Here, I decide to change the window placement and to add in the ship stained glass window. You can't have a pirate ship build without the pirate ship window. I chose the Lion King nightstands for this build because I love the bulkiness feel of them and the richness of colors. I wanted a warm feeling for the room. I also chose the island coffee table as I felt it fit the same vibe. I would also need a place to put the phonograph. I wanted to use as many of the banners and tapestries to decorate the walls of the cabin. So I decided on the royal banners and the map that we get to craft from Prince Eric along with some other items. The captain of a ship has a strong presence and you better have a chair to live up to it. So the Corona chair will do nicely. A few more items to fill out the space. I chose to use the floral wall sconces for my lighting along with some candlesticks. I just like the warm light that the flames give off. A few bits of greenery. Now I had to use the Corona pillars. I felt that they looked like they belonged on a ship. I place them around the table in the center of the room as it is the focal point and we need to make a statement.
a little walkthrough to make sure I am happy with the placement. And a candle chandelier for more lighting and to finish off the build a mannequin to model my pirate outfit. My little sprites, I hope you enjoyed the pirate ship speed build and will give the video a thumbs up. If you would like to become one of my little sprites, please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell to see more content. Have a wonderful day and I hope to see you at the next video. Bye!